Hi, it's Miranda. It's really dark and you can't really see me. I'll try to get a little closer. But that's just because it is past seven o'clock and I'm gonna go get my booster. So, I'll see you later. So I'm home, I have hat hair, but um, I mean, my hair looks the, the big deal vaccine on this side and I have my flu vaccine on this side. I feel regular right now, but I'm sure if it's like last time, I'm gonna have chills and aches in a little bit. And I don't know what the flu shot is gonna do, if anything, to me. It's already eight o'clock and I've been getting tired very easily lately. That was a quick little thing that I haven't been going out lately, so it's like, oh, okay, maybe that woke me up. Sleep will catch up to me soon, so. I might not record anything else tonight, we'll see. We'll see. It's nine o'clock, and I just wanted to share that um, this arm is barely sore. This arm, the flu shot arm, is not sore at all. Band-aid. I'm not feeling anything. So I'm hoping that I can sleep through it. I'm gonna go to bed now. I'll do an update tomorrow. This is um, five o'clock the next day, <laughs> 5 p.m. The only reason I took so long is because, you know, life happens, a lot of things to do. Um, I'm not feeling any symptoms. Last night, I think I had some chills in the middle of the night, but it was also kind of cold, so. My arms feel like I lifted the teeniest little weights ever, and I'm like, oh, I'm a little sore. But otherwise, I feel fine. I'm not even getting that dizziness that I got last time, so hopefully that just won't happen. That was the effects of my booster at this point. It was almost eight o'clock when I got it yesterday, and it's five o'clock now, so. A little less than 24 hours, but not so bad. Get vaccinated. Bye.